How's it going today guys? My name is Ethan and welcome to Rapture. And we are back in Rise of the Tomb Raider today where These ruins are incredible. We are going through ruins. And hopefully getting back. Oh no. Not Looks like Gunner was right about the lost city. The source has to be somewhere down here. Now this wall looks like it was put up in a hurry. I can feel air coming through from the other side. The plan. I'm gonna see if I can break through. Might be another way out. There. No one on the other end but stand. Alright, how are you standing? Right Keep your eyes open. I was meant to make it. Uh, go. Yeah, I don't like that, but... We now have heavy equipment in place within the main cavern. We intend to gain access to some kind of temple, even if we have to rip down its ancient doors to do so. While hundreds of artifacts have now been recovered and catalogued, two guard crews have gone missing in the mines. I have personally questioned the native prisoners, they claim to have no knowledge of the whereabouts of the missing guards. And though we've punished them harshly, I fear they are on the verge of revolt. Probably these guardians, that's whatever you're talking about. They look, it's coming loose, yeah. Use these other cables to rip open the door. Hmm. Someone tried to get through this door before. Oops. Ah! Lovely. I can use these other cables to rip open the door. God damn it. So, if it's gonna let me go down there, why didn't it?
enemies to press fire. Now, look out! It's coming down! Don't you keep fire! Oh. I'm taking fire! Give me some pressing fire! Now! He's hit! This makes sense. If I follow these directions... Wasn't that actually just where I was? Oh no, okay. Oh no, that's where the fight is. Okay. There. that Lara would have a seriously like long break between missions, a hey? gold sword hilt inlaid with jewels. This belonged to a Byzantine noble. Hmm. The blade itself was snapped off at the base. Did this happen in battle? It is imperative that you respond to my communiques. We are now in dire need of supplies and reinforcements. A full revolt is in progress, and the prisoners now control the excavation site and surrounding facilities. In the retribution, I have ordered mass executions of prisoners from the native population. With any luck, these rebels will lay down their arms and surrender to save their own countrymen. Light 
Come on, hit me. Let's finish this. I don't think I was meant to do that. But I'll give it a go. Right, that should work. That should work. the exodus of his people from the deserts of Syria. They settled in a hidden valley and built a great city. Katash. To protect the city and its people, the Prophet raised an army of warriors. 
But what is this showing? It's not the divine source they're holding. It's something else, something else, but what? And his warriors forged for him an atlas that the prophet might always know his city and its secrets. A map of the city. It could show the way to the divine source. Big bit of coin there, but that only equals two coins. It's that a wonder this place is still standing. Easy, easy. You know I'm not with Trinity. Why should we believe you? I escaped with one of yours, a man named Jacob. Where is he now? We were together, but we got separated in the mines. She killed him! No, 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 no. Jacob would never trust an outsider. Please, listen, I am not your enemy. I warned you, you should have left. Sophia! Enough! Father! Ooh. I thought I lost you. I'm glad you made it out of there. Forgive Sophia, she is cautious. In her position, I'd be the same way. What did you find out? Trinity is coming in force. We must prepare. Her. She's a friend. On my word, no harm will come to her. These ruins. We must be near the Prophet's lost city. Come. We do not have much time. Prepare the weapon stores. Secure the battlements. Go. Now. They're almost here. But we're outnumbered. The children and elders are vulnerable. Go. Get them into the catacombs. Light the fires. The valley must be alert. Incredible. Sophia, muster our fighters. Then meet me in the upper village. Don't disappear again, father. There's much to do. Had more time. Later. For now, I'll do what I can to help.
What I mean by that is, I'm looting your whole entire place. You, head down to the old radio. Get the generator working. We need to get one last transmission out. And let the other settlements know what's going on. Hmm. This vase must have been beautiful once. But someone's poked a few new holes in it and filled it with dirt. They must have used it to grow seedlings. I want Hello. to know the moment you see their helicopters. Yes, of course. If we see anything, we'll sound the horns. Go with God. I need more wood for the fire. They needed most of the lumber to repair the guard towers. Another difficult winter for my people. There are more deaths and births now. And as the seasons pass, the young ones are becoming restless. I see them looking to the sky when the rare plane passes overhead. Wistful. Wondering. Longing. I know they are still deeply committed to the cause. But I also sense a change coming. An end to our way of life is on the horizon. The most recent invaders are fading from memory. But as the technology of men advances, more are bound to find our valley again. And we are bound with the fate of this place. For better, or worse. What can we do with what we have? Well, if they need arrowheads for the battle, then I need more firewood. I've already cut plenty. Besides, I don't know how much more time you'll have left. points faster than broadheads. That should be our focus. Alright, now that we've kind of come to a... Uh... Hello there. Greetings. Kind of like a stop here. I'm going to go... Yeah. Just back up here. So we stay the deep three. They can't hit what they can't see. What? They'll cut us down. No matter where we fight. We know this land better than they ever. Where are the... Where? where? Not the chicken pen. I'll find it later. All right, what we're going to do now is we're probably we've got. I'll add a little bit extra onto this episode because we're going to finish up the Baba Yaga area. Well, just hopefully this is just the mission because we're we've got the antidote to where we hit this thing now, so. Jacob and his people are resilient. I'll give them that. Trinity is on their way. They could do with my help. And this atlas from the mural. If it really is some kind of map of the ruins, I've got to find it before Anna. If I don't, then all these deaths will have been in vain. And I can't have that on my conscience. All right. Skills. Oh, wait, it's bad. All right, let's go back and fuck up Baba Yaga. At least I think that's what's happening. Even though it's probably the grandmother, I reckon she's done that. I reckon she's gone down there, like, lost her shit, and just stayed there. That's what I'm thinking anyway. Or, or she was actually killed by the witch Baba Yaga chick and she's actually there. 
So, who knows? Alright. Only enough for two doses. Got to make them count. It's working, Nadia. Everything looks... normal is the wrong word, but nothing like the last time. Good. I've made my own antidote and enough for Grandpa, if we find him. I'm on my way to meet you now. Yeah, Scarecrows, of course. This can't be the same place. I was lost in here. It's all wrong. Lost the old man entering the veil. Lost Fisher. Lost Parker. Just gone. No trace. Can't trust the eyes. Seeing things. Corpses. Worse. Things that walk. So huge they hide the stars. Oh, can't tell what's real. Not sure there is a real. Is it the eyes? The eyes have to go. My hands are steady now. Billings goes first. Stop! Hold still! Nadia, what do you know about these ruins out here? Even before the witch made her home there, our people avoided the veil. The founders were building a shrine out there, but something happened to them. None of us have been in there in generations. Be careful. Even if your visions weren't real, that place is still deadly. And now you already know, I am going into the Vale to kill the witch, Baba Yaga. I have gone to seek revenge for your grandmother. There are newcomers in our valley, armed men arriving in helicopters. I do not know what they want, but I know if I am to go, this is my last chance. You deserve to know the truth, to know why. Your grandpa is not a wise man. I have become, with hard work, a good man, for your grandmother's sake. But it was not always so. I came from the West, where even a small village has thousands of inhabitants. I was a lazy young man, and I dreamed of an easy life when I joined the party. A comfortable desk in a big city. But they sent me here, to the ends of the earth, to watch men and women work and starve and die to participate in their punishment. I knew it was evil, but I did not know how to fight until I met her.
crab out we do it like this then. Um, <sighs> ah. I don't think I'll be able to make it up. Grab that why. It is my great honor to have been given the responsibility of overseeing the construction of a shrine to the Apostles, out in the Far Vale. The site is on the very borders of our newly founded city, through a distant canyon. The natural waterfalls and geothermal springs grant us an amazing opportunity to use our combined knowledge to create a place of solemn worship and reflection that glorifies not only the memory of the Apostles, but also our own recent advances in construction. Already we have outpaced the empire we left behind. We will arrive in the morning and break ground on a shrine to honor our past and the future of our city. Okay, good to know, thank you. Maybe I can connect this to something. Really? Thank you so much, Lara. You're, you're an inspiration to everyone. Yeah, I'm. I, sometimes I think about it. I don't know why I'm so stupid. <laughs> Turns out that's really got nothing to do with anything.
I think that should work. run. all this time. It looks like she even made a few improvements, but I don't think those ropes will survive many more trips. It only needs to make one. Two. I'd like to come back down. Eventually. Your witch is clever. Everything in this veil is arranged to perpetuate the myth of Baba Yaga. The pollen does the rest. Last time I saw the lift, it looked nothing like this. And what did you see? Just as the legend says, a house walking on giant bird legs. But without the pollen, it's just an old contraption. I'm sorry. I was so sure of Grandpa's story. She's Russian, someone who knew the myth well. Nadia, it's possible that your grandfather will know who she is. He was a prisoner in the Gulag, you said. I didn't say that. Not exactly. Grandpa was a guard. My grandmother was the prisoner. She was a brilliant scientist, and they brought her out to the Vale to help study something in the ruins. But then the witch came. Grandpa never forgave herself. Killing the witch won't bring her back, but I understand. Let's just hope we can reach him in time. Let's do this. Nadia, come quick! Nadia? How? Oh. Uh, it's the pollen. Here, let me. Grandpa, can you hear me? I tried. I couldn't save her. I tried. Shh, it's okay now. I'll stay with him, Laura. It's time. You only have one more dose remaining. Make it count. She has to be inside. This is it. 
Bravo team. The missing soldiers, they're here. It's her. Always been her. At the margins, in the dark, always there. She, she is what we came here for. We just didn't know it until now. She is the center of the world. She can make the fog swirl and choke our minds. She can give us clarity. She spoke her name, Baba Yaga, and our wounds healed. With another word, she split us open again. We are nothing, and we are hers. We will do as she commands. We were made for this. Oh God. What has she done to them? That last antidote. <sighs> this is the last of it.
Oh, oh. Hey, I mean, I'm 
Stop. No more. I know who you are. I can only imagine what you've gone through to stay alive. <laughs> you have no idea. It's over now. You don't have to live like this anymore. Serafima. But you died. They, they told me you died. Will she be all right? I don't know. But it won't be easy for any of you. Family never is. Oh, I know. I know. Thank you, Laura, for everything. Hell yeah. That's so cool. Thought I'd give them a little time alone while I look around some more. Oh, I'm gonna quickly go around. to the fire. We'll have a look at what we've got. And I think that'll be it for this episode. Um. Nadia's grandparents, split apart by the Gulag, are reunited. They all have a long and arduous road ahead. Seraphina wore the mask of the witch for so long, I don't know if she will ever be able to fully return to the world. And Yvonne dreamed of killing the witch to get revenge for his lost love, but they were the same woman all along. That wound he nursed for decades won't heal overnight. They're survivors. We all are. But it will be difficult. It will feel impossible some days, I know. At least they'll have a fighting chance now that we know the truth. It may not be enough, but it's a good start. Draw speed. Old times are less, but red of fire is higher. Now, what does the costume look like? That is the real question. Oh god. Okay. Why the hell not? Why not just run around like this for a few episodes? Like. Damn, that draw speed's fast though. And hold that, that. That's enough though, when you think about it. Like. Go! Oh. Alright guys, well I'm gonna end this episode here for today, and in the next one we are going to be continuing with the main story and taking it from there. If you guys want to catch up with me or see anything else going on with the channel, make sure to follow me on my Twitter, which is on the screen in front of you, or in the description down below, and I'll see you guys in the next one.